the comedian walks into the back fence and like the stranger at the bar at one point asks what his occupation is and he says I'm a comedian and the uh, customer of the other guy says you're kidding me Rimsha and he said uh, well you know it pays the rent poetry or comedy comedy What's the difference between a dumb blind and a Panama Canal? <laughs> he knows, he knows. He's not invited. Uh, one's a busy ditch. <laughs> I think I'll do the poetry. I could do the uh, sandwich walks into the back fence. And Catherine said, we don't serve food here. <laughs> Imagine if I had you, you know, you should have stopped me when I, a sandwich can't walk. I raise my glass in a toast to the Long Island coast, to the girls gone swimming in a nighttime of boats, moon colored by light on the water, they float to the shore and the warmth while my hand makes a note to remember in rhyme my poet's devotion to say once in line a young man's emotion said simply and softly a young man's confession to honor the vine and the fruits of the lesson North sky, snow high, ever go to Agua Chen. Crow fly, some guy head off to Agua Chen. Blue eyes, soft, dry, noonday sun in Agua Chen. Nice try, goodbye, never go to Agua Chen. I wanted to want her, I waited and waited. I came back to haunt her, my love was outdated. Are you okay? Even after 17 years, Jim Collier would go right back inside, close the door, draw the curtains. Jim, stay a little longer, have another nice try. Uh, no time. Ever see him down at the uh, post office and he's sort of studying the wanted posters and, and you think you can hear him mutter under his breath, you know it boy, keep moving. Yeah, I've been thinking about Jim. No one just knows where he's gone. I think you would have heard it after three weeks. Sheriff says someone over in Jefferson came to report a drowning and half moon lake. It's a car <coughs> traveling down the road. This is a very long involved. John, can I do this? I've never done this one. <laughs> I didn't hear what you said as long as it's not pooping. I mumble, I mumble on my uh, business card. Um, the artist asked the critic his, his opinion of his painting. The artist says, I'd, I'd like to know what you have to say. And the critic says, it's worthless. And the artist said, I know that, but I'd like to hear it anyway. <laughs> I have come to the park to sit and watch the day and ducks and squirrels and young men in bunches stripped to the waist to sleep and to tan and like the others who ran when they saw the hands of the clock nearing one and were shocked by jobs and the time that now was the time to put on the mask and the cap on the flask and 
back to their task of moving the clock to the dark of the day and keep me away because like each other day it ends the same way when I come to the park to see. John, can I do one more? Go ahead. Easy for you to say. The fans still, this is about boxing uh, for any of you uh, sports addicts. The fans still pay to see a fight, and I might too, to see a right break some hero's nose and to ignore the voice of the remaining few cigar freaks, pretending that they all knew the fight game when it was on the square, and the old days when people really cared, and for 40 rounds they sat and stared and feasted and drank their love of love, spit in the bucket and swing your gloves, cursing and stamping, paying their debts and living their lives of give and get. I don't feel like starting. I ain't in the yard. I have found something else and the smell of my sweat ain't mixed in the night with pain and regret, just music and poems and wine on the breath. And since it's Sunday, I'll do one last one. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Sitting on a Sunday with these people and around, thinking in a big way what I lost, I thought was found in the chorus of Atlantis. The repeating of the sound made us feel quite holy as our hands something touch the ground in communion of the senses and the freezing of the time and the falling of the fences which exposed our open minds to the smiling and singing faces as we understood the line way down below the ocean for it made us feel just fine to sing of going places where there aren't any traces of the city or races and you don't know what the pace is kind of prove that you know that there's a chase inside your mind and you're glad you finally saw the sign in the meadow, in the park, in the dream on Sunday wine. Thank you very much.